I'm here with uh, Nick Franklin, and uh, Nick, what have you got to show? Uh, so I've started kind of putting together the Arduino-based ignition system. Um, I'm trying to figure it out and write code, but basically what this is going to do is allow us to use the computer to tell the car to turn the ignition on, tell the car to start the, car, or to start the motor, um, to shut it off, and all that. So kind of figuring it out. It's a bit of a process, but... Um, this is just kind of proof, proof of concept right now. So, yeah. So here's a, it looks like an Arduino Uno. Uh, it's the Dead Mini Dual uh, Mininova. Yeah, which I, I think is a, a circuit, I, I think is a circuit chip on an Uno. Um, I think. And then these jumpers, there's only four wires going out to the car. And which wires are they going to? To a relay that then attaches um, to the ignition? Actually, we're using a digital output on the Arduino right here. This is uh, supplying uh, 12 volts, or sorry, 5 volts to this uh, transistor, which is actuating the relay over here. And that relay tells, supplies power to the starter and the ignition system and everything else. Okay, and how many relays need to be controlled? It looks like there's three. Uh, there's three right there. And there's which ignition, are they? ignition two, and start. What's ignition versus ignition two and... Uh, oh, the positions. Like, well, like, like when the keys first weigh in? It's usually the first click is accessory, uh -huh. but I'm not do, like dealing with accessory right now. Uh -huh. um, second click is ignition and ignition two. And what ignition two is, is it supplies power to the radio, or not the radio actually, uh, but like the heating and cooling system. That's why your fans, like your heater turns off when you start your car, because oh. ignition two doesn't have power when it's in the start position. But ignition one does because it has to continue supplying power to the injectors and the uh, coil packs and everything else like that to actually start the car. So it so. turns off power to most other devices getting right. ready to start so it has all exactly. the juice available to crank. Exactly. So I'm not actually even dealing with Ignition 2 right now. It's just there for future. Are the relays being activated uh, currently with the setup? No, right now it's not, but that's what I was going to show you. Okay. So... Okay, so basically what I'm going to do is we're going to set this pin high and the Arduino is programmed so that when it, when it sees that pin 2, yeah, when it sees that pin 2 uh, gets 5 volts, then it's going to tell the, the uh, ignition relay to turn on. So I'm going to go ahead and put that to 5 volts right here. I heard it. There's the fuel pump. And this would basically be replaced by a switch. Yeah. in the future, mm -hmm. but I'm just doing it manually there. And then to start it right now, I don't have this running through the Arduino, but I can just do this. 